start tonight with a story that impacts Dominion Energy customers, a possible rate hike on your energy bill. News 2's Katie Augustine joins us live from Mount Pleasant. And Katie, a state lawmaker says now is not the right time for increased costs. Sophia, that's right. State Representative Marvin Penn Darvis says people are already paying more at the gas pump and at the grocery store. He's hopeful that a meeting tomorrow morning with Dominion Energy leaders will convince the company to hold off on a rate hike. Energy giant Dominion Energy requesting a rate increase, which would leave customers shelling out extra cash. The company is requesting a 5.19% rate hike, which they say would be about $650 for the average customer. It's attributed to rising costs in natural gas, coal, and oil, materials needed to provide customers with power. We need to make sure that we're not creating an extra burden on people. For many, an extra $6 is one more thing adding stress to their wallets after the pandemic caused financial hardship. State Representative Marvin Pendarvis says he's concerned about the impacts of those extra costs. And when we're looking at how the gas prices have increased to a point where it's really affecting people's ability uh, to, to, to commute, to pay their rent or to pay their mortgage, to child care, um, to get groceries and so many other issues. So the issues that already existed, um, they're only exacerbated now because of the fact that costs are higher. A Dominion Energy spokesperson says in part, quote, we must recover the costs of purchasing and transporting fuel to produce the electricity our customers rely on every day. Pendarvis meeting with Dominion Energy leaders Tuesday to fight for the people in need of some financial relief. One, I hope for a better understanding as to why they believe the time is now for them to, to ask for this increase. Um, two, I'm hoping that we can come to a consensus as to how we move forward. Dominion Energy has a hearing in front of the Public Service Commission on April 7th. Commissioners are expected to have a decision on the request by the end of April. And if it is approved, customers could start seeing those higher bills come May 1st. Live in Mount Pleasant, I'm Katie Augustine. Count on two.